guys welcome again to prophetic words and teachings they didn't want you to have anything you see the enemy knows that if you have certain things you will be empowered to do great that great things and just as it was with um laban and jacob for a while everything was going well and then Laban started to think that he could cheat Jacob and he could just deprive him of what was supposed to be his. And the enemy just thinks that if they let you continue, you will be greater than them. You will achieve greater things. You become a threat to them. But the Lord will fight for you. In that place that they think that the land will be dry, there shall be green grass, there shall be growths, there shall be a lot of progress, a lot of a lot of growth for you in that place because they thought that they could deprive you of everything even the little things you see they don't they do not they do not wor worry about themselves they worry about you because they think that as long as they can keep you in a, in a place of dryness then they are fine you see that is how the wicked things they just want to make sure that you, you you never get to that place where you become a threat to them so even the little things even the little achievements is it is threatening to them even though they have more than you right now they are still threatened by you they do not even want you to have little that is how dark the heart of man is that is the kind of evil that the lord is protecting you from and if you could open your eyes and see it that is why the, sometimes the lord tells you to, to keep short about certain achievements and keep short about certain things. When the Lord begins to open certain doors, not everyone should be welcome into that door. Not everyone should be aware even of the existence of that door because they will try to shut it. They will try to frustrate it. So avoid your necessary frustrations and battles that they will bring by knowing certain things. They do not want to see you grow even in the littlest way, even in the tiniest way. The devil does not want the progress of the children of God. No matter how, how much... How, how small it looks that they, they will try to end it they will try to quench that fire just as they did with joseph just as they were trying to do with joseph just as they were trying to do with david Saul was after him even though he was greater than him at that moment in, in the eyes of men he was in a position where he could easily crush him but he but then the the, the god that was in david was greater than any king was greater than any earthly crown and that was what saved him you will achieve great things even though your enemies do not want you to achieve those things yes you will start from small but you will grow into bigger bigger achievements as long as you are working with the lord the things that you will achieve are not things that money can achieve are not things that money can buy it will be evident that it is the grace of god that took you from that little to abundance i'll see you guys next time